Hey everyone, just want to make a quick video. Uh, wanted to discuss something that I just saw from the quarter crew. They posted a video of them making this anime using stable diffusion. They talked about all the techniques they used and it looked really, really good. Something that stood out to me that I have not been using in any of the animations I've generated is the Flickr tool from DaVinci Resolve. I want to show you the results and also how to do it in DaVinci Resolve. And this is my results from an animation that I generated in my last video. If you're curious about that, there should be a link above. And the one on the left is without the deflickering tool and the one on the right is with a deflickering tool. And this is just me adding it with the background just to kind of make a really cool animation there. Um, but you can see how much flickering is going on on the left side. I mean, it makes a world of a difference. Yeah, so how do you do that? Uh, let me show you right now. I don't know if this only works with DaVinci Resolve Studio because that's what I owned. I own the studio version. So you put the video in here and then you drag it into the timeline. And uh, once you put in the timeline, you're gonna come down here where it says Fusion. And here in Fusion, you're not gonna have these. But uh, in Fusion, you should see this right here. And then you're just gonna click shift space and then type in they were using this thing called dirt removal but i just applied it because they did it should automatically uh put that in here but if it doesn't uh just line this up right here so after this uh you press shift space again and and you type in the flicker and add it um here in the flicker you're going to come up here on this the flicker setting and you're gonna put floral light and then you're just gonna control C to copy and then control V to make copies. You know, uh, in the video they show that they did multiple copies so that it can smooth out a little better. And basically it should help reduce a lot of the flickering. So that's how you do that. You come to deliver, you name it, uh, whatever you want, and then the location, the the format and then add to render queue then render all and then it's done so this is just a really quick video of how i did this hopefully uh, it was helpful and you know i know that uh, a lot of people might be looking for this information now that uh, they know that this is kind of something that uh, looked really well in another video so yeah all right guys see you guys in the next video